Welcome back to Dark Messiah of Might and Magic. Well, I've gotten Percy to safety, and I can just leave right now if I wanted to. But I still have the optional objective of killing the zombie Cyclops. So, let's try to do it. I just don't actually know how. It doesn't look like there's anything around here that I could maybe break to have fall on its head, like I did for the other Cyclops. Ugh. That thing smells like dead meat. Of course, it's dead. It serves Aaron here. Now aim for the eye. Yeah, obviously you need to hit it in the eye. Uh, but doing that with a sword is going to be a little bit tricky. There is this place down here. I have no idea where this goes. Mmm, that high quality water. Well, I actually could make it to the other side, I think. Hello, magic mushroom. This time I didn't F you, I E'd you. This doesn't actually open, does it? Oh, oh, oh god, that is not where I wanted to go. Okay, oh, 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 oh. Keep, keep sliding me around. Calm down, game. <sighs> let's not go down there. Well, actually, let's go down there for the magic mushroom, and then let's leave. What the? <laughs> that was weird. <laughs> he didn't want to grab the ladder at all, but he still survived. No! Don't kick it! Oh, thank god, the magic mushroom is too high to kick it. Okay. Need Ugh. a stab in the eye, so that I need thing smells I need like to get high. Meat. Of course, it's dead. It serves Aaron here. Now aim for the eye. Need a height. Uh, if I get up there, that might be okay. Oh god! Yes, yes! Maybe I get up here. Come on. Oh! <laughs> Ricochet off and then turn into a rope. Ah, it's hitting the railing. Hmm. There we go. If it's so hard to actually get this to actually stick in, then I don't think I'm really supposed to go here. I'm guessing this doesn't open. Okay, that was weird. Come on. Yeah, come on. I'm stuck. Alright, that is not working. Nope. Also, there's a rendering error with that bush. For some reason, the bush is being rendered behind the fence, even though it's obviously in front of it. Might be hard to tell, but it definitely is, just because of the way it's moving. That's weird. That makes me uncomfortable. I don't like it. Huh. Eh. You see that? Look at that. It's like a weird optical illusion. Anyway, maybe just throw a barrel at its eye. Eh... Uh. Okay, that didn't quite work. What did that even, what did that even hit? Take him, not me! Actually, I wonder if this will actually maybe rebound the attack. Let's see. Uh, nope. Ah. Oh god. Shouldn't you try to eat me and not yell in my face? Seems kind of ineffective. Oh god. Ah! Gross! What are you doing? Haha! -ha. I have exploits!
Probably can't get me here, right? Ooh, maybe this is yeah, maybe this is my opportunity to stab it when it like tries to tries to look down here. I guess I ran away in frustration. Come back. Yeah, let's get us to look down here again. I need a stabbing motion. Here we go. Come on. Oh, damn it. I don't know if I did anything. Oh, he's angry. Oh! Oh! I could feel that one. Oh my god. My entire body just got crushed into a paste there. I could also shoot in the eye with a rope arrow, but that would take a lot of rope that arrows. Felt good. Oh, hey. Ooh, ooh, here we go. Here we go. That was perfect because I was right there. Come on. Come on. Alright, stabbing motion. Uh. Okay, <laughs> I thought he was gonna glitch me through the whole thing for a second. Alright, I think I stabbed him. It's so cute the way he picks up stuff. Oh, yeah. Oh, damn it. Alright, I need to stay back. It's alright, though. This throwing thing doesn't take that. It doesn't do that much damage to me. Seems to be the way to go. I think it's kind of like the spider, where you just have to bait its bait its attack and then stab it in the face. points for that? I'm assuming I did, but I didn't actually look. Nine skill points. Still saving up for 12, so I can go for adrenaline, I guess. Do I want to go for adrenaline? I really don't know if I care. If I don't go for that, what should I go for? I don't care about mana. Mm, could go for more critical hits. But it's such a tiny, tiny increase in critical hit chance. 2% and then the next one's 4%. It just doesn't seem worth it. Eh, I guess I'll go for adrenaline. Alright, I'm coming, Percy. We're done. <laughs> he just teleports out of existence, and then loading screen. <laughs> Such elegance. Optional. Ah! Bathe yourself in the blessed waters of the sanctuary of Yulath. If you wish to purge Xana from your soul, I do. I don't like her. She's in my head. She's a demon, and she seems to want nothing more than to have sex with me. She's kind of creepy. And if I purge her from my soul, 
I'm guessing that's going to give me the good ending or something. I don't actually remember if this game has multiple endings, but it probably does. It's probably going to give me the good ending. <laughs> what is he looking at? <laughs> it's probably going to give me the good ending, and I think it's also going to make it so I can use the Dragon Claw Sword or whatever that thing was called. Where is it? Um, 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 erm, um, erm. Um. There it is. Yeah, sort of the Dragon Claw. Damage 9, plus 18 against undead creatures. Unfortunately, I can't actually use it right now because... I'm gonna have to remember this. I should try it again later. It looks powerful. You already have other powers. Forget this. Although, I don't know if I actually want to use it. It does do 9 damage, whereas this, the base damage of the Earthfire Sword is 6. So, significant increase in base damage. But the Earthfire Sword says plus 12 against enemies vulnerable to fire, and I think a lot of enemies are vulnerable to fire. Whereas this one is only plus 18 against undead creatures, which make up a relatively small amount of the enemies that I kill. So, I don't know. But I'm going to purge her from my soul regardless. Alright, do I still have to protect you? If Percy hates you or Percy dies, your mission is a failure. Okay, I do. Also need to find the Sanctuary of Yilath. Y Yilath. Let's go, Percy. Don't die. Can you jump? Hope you know how to jump. I can jump. See? I lead by example. That was close. Okay, jump, Percy! <laughs> I want to see what this animation is going to look like. Ah, <laughs> Are you alright? I'll try to find another way through. If I can, I'll run around and meet you just up the street. If we didn't need him, I'd tell him to just keep running. Annoying man. Thank God I don't have to babysit him anymore. I hear them. I see them. All of those miss. Ooh, that aggressive lunge. Generic Tavern. Damn, all the doors are locked. I kind of wish I had um, the skill here, Burglar. Allows you to lockpick doors and detect traps. I don't care about the traps, but lockpicking lock doors would be nice. I mean, I could go for it, but it feels kind of pointless at this point in the game. Eh... <coughs> uh. Apparently I'm on fire. <laughs> What's burning me? There's nothing here. Wow. I guess it's just the, the heat radiating off of this fire. Some strong heat. Ooh! Pies to stuff in my pants. Hmm. I think that's a secret. Yes, yes it is. <clears throat> or is it? It actually just looks like maybe where I'm supposed to go. Hmm. 
Where does this go? Maybe this leads to the temple, to the optional objective? This being Sarath, son of Isabel. Ugh, what is that stench? It smells like dragon magic. Oh, I think I am going the right way to purge my soul. Ah, yes, 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 yes. I think I remember this, actually. You can't possibly want to go in here, my love. Enter and be uplifted. Set aside your demonic nature and feel the blessings of Asha as sun on your face. You know... I think my character might be crazy. I mean, I have so many people, so many people's voices inside of my head just talking. Like, where are they coming from? <laughs> Ew. Aw, sacred urn. out of here. <laughs> That's too much fun. Oh, shadow steel armor. I think I might finally have an upgrade of my armor. Four armor glass. Right now this gives me three. Or, yeah. So from three to four. And adds ten health. That is really good. It's about time. Because I've been using this plate armor for hours and hours. Beautiful. Hello! I'm Delan. Liana told me about this. Come in. Did she? Did she text you? Forever. Nope. You can't do this. Stop it. Stop it or else. Ah, the light. It's tearing me apart. I'll burn your soul for this. My love. I swear I'll have your soul. What have you done, my son? There will be a reckoning for this. A reckoning in blood. You have indeed proven yourself worthy for abandoning the temptations of the unholy fire. I grant unto you a gift of pure light. Use it well, Sarath, son of Isabel. Use it well. Who are you? An ancient enemy of your father's. Now. Go forth and reclaim the skull of the seventh dragon, ere the world end in ash and flame. I love the story in this game. <laughs> oh, it's such generic fantasy nonsense. Bow of the dragon horn? Horn. Not dragonborn. Dragon horn. I don't use bows. I don't use staffs. I don't use daggers. Thank you for giving me three weapons I don't use. I guess it's because I already have the the sword of the dragon claw. That's probably why it didn't give me a sword. I, I guess maybe. What a bunch of useless weapons. All right. Well, now I got twelve points. So let's go for adrenaline. Cause why not? Now, do I want to use the sword of the dragon claw? 
Hmm. I feel like I don't. But I do want to see what it looks like. Okay. It's got a nice piss yellow glow. Very long and pointy. I feel like it attacks faster. Hold on, let's see if it does. Hmm. Nah, it's the same speed. Alright, well let's use it for a bit, see how it feels. Just need to find Percy. Let's get out of here. Where did that guy go? Hope he didn't get burned. What do you see? Hey! Oh! <laughs> I just wanted to see what would happen. <laughs> How did he die? It's like I kicked him so hard that I crushed his, like, his chest into the rail and... <laughs> okay, let's not do that. I had to try. You know, in another dimension, I feel like this went very differently. But in this one, you're fine. Don't worry. Ooh, undead. Nice to get to test out my sword. Okay, we're good. You know, I would like to know why the undead are just rising out of the graves right next to a temple. Like, shouldn't this whole place be completely blessed and, you know, good to go? It's a little bit weird. Ooh, I think this is where I'm supposed to go. Give me a sword. I can fight. You'll get a chance to prove your valor soon enough. And if you hold still and let me heal this, you might even live to tell about it. Look out! Here they come again! Hmm? Ghoul! Flanking on the left! Drive them back! <clears throat> You need to be really careful that I don't hit them. Two people that died aren't good, but we're good. Yeah, sword seems pretty effective. I like it so far. Doesn't seem less effective than the fire sword against these ghoul things. Maybe the ghouls aren't actually susceptible to fire. Uh, 
That did nothing. Why can't I attack you? What the? <laughs> Come on, Seraph? Seraph? What's your name? I don't even remember your name exactly. I can't attack it! He won't finish it. He won't finish a swing on anything. What the? Okay, he'll finish a strong attack. But not a weak attack. Ooh, thank you. Oh, that's so cool! I didn't know you could do that. Okay, there we go. Now it's fixed. That was so weird. <laughs> you can hear the sound of flies coming to eat the body, even though the body is completely frozen. Is his name Seraph or Sereth? I keep forgetting. Sereth. Seraph. Seraph. I think it's Seraph. I just gotta remember. Sans Seraph Font. Thieves outfit. Not for me, but I'll take it. Cause shiny. <laughs> you can grab a you can grab a collection of plates, not just one. And these look like they're metal, so I don't think they're gonna break. <laughs> nope. Lightning shield? That I already have. For a second I thought he was Percy. All right, a lot of zumbles around here. Let's get some high ground. Ooh, that's a trap, isn't it? <laughs> and there's a scrolls of fire traps. I wonder what kind of a trap that is. Perhaps fiery? There we go. Looks like it was a good idea to go for this sword and purify my soul, because it looks like there's a lot of zombies suddenly. You made it this far. Let's see if I can get you inside. Wait, you were worried about me? I think I should be more worried about you. Maybe I should join the guards. They always need volunteers. See the grid? I'll open it up for you once you've raised the water level enough. Then I'd better start the water. That's the valve over there. You'll need to turn it and open the flow. Once you've got that going, I'll open up the grid and you can get inside. Who are you talking to? I'm not there anymore. Weirdo. Oh, where's the where's the valve? I'm assuming it's inside, or is it over here? Oh, it's probably over here. You won't make it. That's it. Keep it. Right.
And we're good. Wait, I hear more. Yeah. I think he got confused there for a second. Here we go. I wonder if this is a time limited thing. Nope, looks like we're good. It went over his head. We good? I think I just need to swim. Now let me do this so you can get into the citadel. Good luck. Thank you. He's so gonna die as soon as I leave. <laughs> Such a weird contraption. There's just a huge chain going from the freaking window over to here. Like what the heck? That does not seem like good engineering. Launch myself in the loading zone again. Oh yeah. Aw, oh, it's another Percy clone. Percy sure gets around. Pretty. Uh, do I hear a dragon? I'm pretty sure I hear a dragon. Hmm. Almost had it. Just a health potion that I can't pick up. Yay! Maybe there's something over here? Nope. Maybe there's something over here. Secrets? <gasps> Magic mushroom! Oh god, now I just need to get back. Uh... you do that? Getting there is fine, but getting back is hard. Alright, one more try. There we go. Just had to do a weird little leap. Oh yeah, that's the dragon. That didn't seem like fire. What the hell was that? Oh god, it's locked. That's not good. A door this large needs something mechanical to open it. Alright, need to find some mechanical device. Gotcha. I'm guessing attempting to kill it would probably be a very bad idea right now. Or, well, maybe not. Maybe, maybe this could work. I'm seeing blood. Can I cut off its tail? All right, mechanical device, huh? 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 Mechanical. Oh. Probably something higher up. How's it going? <laughs> it's just waiting patiently for me. Throw a blade at it. Die. Foul fiend. 
Just what I was looking Ooh. for. Too bad I can't carry one with me. I'm taking a lot of damage here. Magic mushroom. Kaplunk. Actually, more like a disappear. Now I can breathe easy. Given the size of that door, I think this would take about 200 revolutions. Oh, it's unlocking. Or, going back down, I mean. Go! Faster! Ooh! Sarah! I was afraid you wouldn't make it. I wouldn't go through with it. So happy for you. For us. We're not a couple. What do you Hurry on. <sighs> I'll come as soon as I've rested. I've been fighting necrolords all over town. I promise I won't make Aaron here beg for mercy until you're there to hear it. <laughs> we are the shittiest video game couple. <laughs> She's humming to herself now. <laughs> like we don't even know each other. <laughs> but it's like we're like high school sweethearts or something and have been together for ten years. Glowy things. So right at the end of the game. Which means, uh, I guess... If I didn't take the School of Shadows from Aaron here. Yeah, I guess my fears were correct. That I'm only going to get to use the adrenaline and these kind of late game skills for a very short amount of time. And that's with me focusing 100% on getting these skills. You know, not diffusing my skills in anything other than melee. And of course, you know, endurance to support my melee attacks and stuff like that. And that's also with doing all of the optional objectives. It's kind of surprising. Ooh. <laughs> this place is really cool looking. Whoa, what the... My father is the King Prodek, one of four dead kings of Stonehelm, whom Arantir has conscripted to block your path. Release my body into the Great Abyss, and I will speak with my father on your behalf. I'm not sure I have the time. <laughs> That's a classic line. Oh my god. I love you, Sans Serif. <laughs> Just listens to the wailing of this tormented soul. It's like, I don't know if I have the time. <laughs> what a dick. Oh, I'm so gonna get lost here? My god. This is like Dark Souls.
Okay, I can make my way up there. Hey, pal. I ain't your pal, buddy. I missed. Get off. Get off. Ooh, it's a good way to go. Yeah, I'm trying to profile all the different directions I can go before I start going in one way. So many things I can climb up on. There's gotta be a lot of secrets down here. Not that I need them, because I have a feeling I'm never gonna use a new weapon or a piece of armor or anything until the end of the game. But you never know. Some potions over there, but I don't need them. be something to do up here. Unfortunately, everything's stone, so there's nothing to shoot my uh, rope arrows into. Hmm. Guess there really isn't much up here. Almost got my second hit off. Oh! He didn't die from that? Wow, he just got crushed by like 2,000 tons of stone and he didn't die. Dude's got a hard body. Oh my god, that one's really precarious. I, I don't want to be under that. <gasps> Look at it. There's no way that'd be supported by that wood. No way! That stone would weigh thousands of pounds. And those boards are like a couple inches thick. I don't know about you, but... That zombie hanging out there is a little bit creepy. Why is it there? There's also Cthulhu noises coming from the light. I don't like it. Secret? Nope, where I'm supposed to go. Come say hi. Von's Watcher. 
He who watches the body of the Ravisher, the Sadist, the violator of the king's gentle Harris, or Eris, and poisoner of his only seed. May his torment be eternal. Ugh. He's doing his own little dance number over there. Okay, looks like if I stay at this range, he continues to dance. So let's not get too close. I want to see him. Look at him go. The great peace shall soon be yours. I can't even kick him. Go down there. I don't know if there's anything down there, though. This place is so confusing. Okay, where am I supposed to go? Oh, I think I am supposed to go down, actually. I'm not so sure. Whoa, 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 whoa. Alright, let's try going down here. So back on the other side of this. Don't know if that actually helps, though. But yeah, I think I'm supposed to go down. Continue to go down. How would I do that without dying? Whoa, 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 whoa. Almost went off the edge there. <laughs> ah, I need to get back up. thing I can break. Hmm. Seems suspicious. Ah. That's one. Oh, am I letting the zombie thing fall <clears throat> down? I'm unpinning it, aren't I? Yeah, I just let off one side. That's weird. I don't understand what this is going to accomplish. Uh. Isn't this where I do this side? Whoa, 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 whoa. can't seem to touch it. Oh god. Oh god. I don't understand the point of this. Maybe it's just to be able to climb down on the chain? But if I let down the other side, then I can't climb down it. This is weird. Got 
God damn it. Jump. Yeah, there's there's no pin in it. Oh, this is the optional part. Yeah, drop the body into the abyss, thereby releasing him from torment. So I don't actually need to do this, but of course I want to. Can I live? No. Yeah, okay. Hmm. Well, given that the other release was really far over there, maybe this release is, for some reason, further over this way? Oh yeah, like, right there? Come on. Yeah, here we go. That's two. Hmm? Here we are. Ishtban should be free now. Let's go double check and make sure he's free. Huh? Nice, pleasant, glowy orbs are coming from the glowy hole. That's a good thing, right? Wait a minute, it still says optional drop his body into the into the abyss. It's not checked off. Hmm. Weird. Have some pottery! I don't even know where it went. Like it disappeared into the ether. Jump down there. And you know what? I actually might be able to survive that fall. Oh yeah, we're good. Oh my god, am I supposed to go down there myself? Uh, I'm scared. You have freed me. Very well. Before I descend into the abyss, I will keep my word. And mark you for my father's eyes. When he sees you, he will know you, and your way will be opened. Go now and greet my father. Oh, thank you very much. Another optional objective talk to the king. Okay, I don't actually know where to go to talk to him, but uh, I'm sure I can find it. I think I might just have to drop down into the light. I'm not sure. Anyway, I think this is a pretty good place to end the episode. Look at those orbs. They're so fast. It's like... Alright, well, I hope you've enjoyed so far, and I'll be back soon.